Next Radio with Broadcast Bionics, innovative solutions for creative people. Hello. Thanks. Good morning, everyone. Um, yeah, does it work? So, my name is Dominic Born. I work for the TPC, which is um, an affiliated company from the Swiss public broadcaster. And um, during the hack days, um, uh, last September, these two smart guys had an idea. It's called the Music Ban. And um, it's quite easy because they said, we like radio, but we hate some songs. Perhaps you know DJ Bobo? Yeah, someone? Eat? Okay, yes. Who hates it? All right. <laughs> Not that much. Um, so they had the idea to create a player which overlays some bad music, but only for you. So it's quite an easy one. It's, it's a really easy hack. And it looks like this, that you uh, create a playlist, a blacklist of songs that you don't like, or bands. And even then, it directly removes. So this is how it sounds like and looks like. And it's, it's the hack. So they created over 24 hours in one venue. Danke. Danke. So there is the presenter. Von Ifolor Foti Ifolor so now the pointer sisters, and as you can see on the blacklist, there are the pointer sisters, and it removes. Quite easy job. And um, they done it with a SoundCloud. And we said, okay, SoundCloud is quite cool, and um, we realize the idea has something. So that's why we go further with these guys. And what we created was uh, this kind of a player. So, um, and it's not only a band player, so it also have some good sides. So the idea is more that if you hear to a song, I know um, the guys from the BBC Should've have the PBC playlist, it's similar to that. But um, on this one, go you uh, hear a song, you like it, and then it's on, on the right hand. And then you can export it as a playlist to SoundCloud or to YouTube. But it's also good because we use the good list for the bad list. So if you like some songs, then we replace with this songs the bad songs. Quite easy. And this is how it goes. So you listen to a song, and this is the, the little brother of band. It's only the skip. So you press the button, so you hear a song. And they say, uh, not now, please. So, and it replaced by a song you already liked over YouTube. So um, we, we hacked YouTube, or we, we, we choose the API of YouTube, that you can also have the video. But it's radio, so you don't need the video. And um, after that, uh, another song starts in the radio. It fades out. And um, after the fade, it starts with the other song from the live radio. So there is no, you cannot hear it. If you uh, use it passively, there is no more annoying songs anymore. So, and what's for the radio station quite important is we have some data. So the data are quite important for the editorial stuff. Uh, to realize which song the people like, which songs they don't like. And we use it with Google Analytics, okay? We, we could start a discussion how it, but it's free, so that's why we used it. And um, so we have the, the data not only for the bands, but also for the likes. And if we use it with a Facebook single sign-on that we know if the guy has a, muta a moustache or, or he likes dogs or whatever, <laughs> so it's quite easy to use it as well. So... Um, this one shows which songs they like. And here is the ultimate band. So you open up the, the application and then you realize, oh, I really hate, um, James already mentioned Nickelback. So let's uh, choose it with Nickelback. I tried it. So we go to the band and say, never Nickelback anymore. <laughs> so you write it in, Nickelback. And then, yeah. And then you start the player. With the blue in the hall, Kayuka. Dancing at the Blue Lagoon. Möglicherweise der Sound Summer hit. Außer ihr wählt noch einen anderen auf SRF 3.
It's heaven, isn't it? And it's the only, it, which I really like is the only bam. You only hear it, bam, a little bit, and you say, Nick, back to it. <laughs> it's quite an easy job. It's quite easy to do, and uh, it's already there, so you can use it. It's called musicband.ch. It, uh, it works, first of all, with browsers, but we plan to implement it also for a website or, or an application so uh, that you can listen it on in the car or whatever. So it's quite easy. You can use it. Um, it's uh, mainly together with Swiss radio stations, so perhaps you, but it's only for the Czech. And um, yeah, that's it. Thank you very much. <laughs>